We're here in Seattle. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Los Angeles Angels taking on the Seattle Mariners. First pitch coming at you right after the break. Just about set to go now. And today's starting pitcher, Robbie Ray. Mike. And now batting Mike Trout is Chris. And it's huge when you don't have to sit a guy or platoon him. When you can hit, you know, both sides in terms of pitcher's arms, you're a guy. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. Bangs off the wall. And he's in at second with a two-out double. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted That's his good. hands. Nice job of going. And now the lefty swing and a miss. And that is that. Angels strand one. Angels nothing. Mariners coming to bat. It's Major League Baseball, and it's on the show. Bottom of the first. And on the hill, the big righty, Shohei Otani. Going to be hard to top his last start, Singy. He was outstanding. Complete game shutout. He got some great support from his defense. He's got the swing and miss stuff. Everything working for him. We'll see if he's got it today. And the righty deals. Swing and a miss. That one in the dirt. Beats him for the first out, and that completes the strikeout. Righty to the plate. Bounce to the right side. Fletcher handles the chance, tosses to first, and Winker is set down. And the inning is over. Mariners are down in order. Scoreless after one. You're not ready for that pitch. You're just going to swing and miss or pop it up, waste the at-bat. You're going to let it go. You better be ready to swing it. And down on strikes. Third out, and that ends the frame. Angels leave one. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. The pitch. And down on strikes he goes to gone. Off to a strong start, Singy, as he's punched out three of the first five he's faced. Well, he's definitely minimizing contact. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. Impeccable command in that one. Three batters, three strikeouts. That's electric stuff out there on the mound. The pitch. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes and one away in the top of the third. This one in the air right field. Hanniger makes the catch and that'll do it. Angels go down one, two, three. Still no score. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Nobody left for Seattle, and we are still scoreless. Mike Trout. A rope into right, and that's a base hit. Around first and hustling for second. In safely. It's a double, and his second hit. Two hits for him in this one. Both for yeah, extra man. bases. Got to feel good baseball. about that. He really yeah, shot yeah. that one down the right yeah. field line and somehow found a way to keep it from slicing foul. One thing that was great about the approach, his head was down all the way through the pitch, and that's how you do it. And now it's going to be Jared Walsh. Got him swinging. Not what you're looking for after the leadoff double. A strikeout. And there's one away. Swing and a miss, and he chases that one in the dirt. That completes the strikeout, and that'll do it. Angels strand one, and we're still knotted at zero. Here comes the pitch. Runner breaks for second. There's a ball, the tag, and he's out at second. Wow, what an incredible throw right there. And he might not have had time to get to his feet and catch that runner. That's an incredible display of arm strength. Back to work, 3-2 now. In the air, left field. Winker glides back, stretches out and hauls it in. Halfway through this one, still no score. 
Here's a one two. And a swing and a miss. So he's gotten deep into this game. And at least so far, not showing a ton of signs of fatigue. The one two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. That's the inning. Mariners are down in order. And we are still scoreless. The pitch. That one is absolutely belted way back there. Got it. Bangs against the wall but holds on. Now batter. Now fly ball to right center. Makes the grab. Nice play after the long run. And that will end the inning. Mariners go down quietly there. Still no score. On the bump, Anthony Misevich. And this is his season debut. Well, on paper, it's favorable to have a fairly quick inning here with two of the three hitters he's set to face batting from the left side. Same side he throws from. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes and one away. Batting Tyler Wade. The pitch. And that one hammered. That's back there. That's going. Turning and looking, and it's gone. He leaves the yard to right. His first homer of the year. It's 1 0. So now you got to hope your teammate behind you can pick you up. Now Trout gets a chance to hit. On the ground, right side. Marte collects it. Throws to first. And that is the third out of the inning. One in the inning, and it comes from a rather unlikely power source. And the home team down to run. Many years ago, we saw this possibility. Just foul. Swing and a miss. Curveball in the dirt. Gets him. One away on a drop third strike. Up next for Seattle, the right fielder, Mitch Henniger. Now batting Mitch Henniger. The Mariners hitless so far in the game. The next offering misses. Two and one. Definitely a frustrating day for the offense, but when they look at it, this guy's had his best stuff. He's painting the corners, working on the edges, and changing speeds. Just this one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And gone. There goes the perfect game. Mitch Hanniger sends it out. Third home run of the season. It's tied at one. Pitch he wanted to hit, spent on some other pitches in this at bat, was very patient, and it paid off. Here comes the skipper, and we're going to see a pitching change in this spot. Otani will depart. We'll be back in a minute with a new arm on the mound. The other way for the knock. Now a huge at bat in this game coming up. That's ripped into the outfield. Trap puts it away. That is the inning. But some late inning heroics as this home run gets us even again. All even at one apiece. This one smoked out to left. Winker makes the catch, and that'll do it. And 9 1 2 scheduled to lead off the bottom of the nine. All tied 1 1. Tonight. Up the middle and a base hit. Just enough. Here's Cattell Marte. Right handed reliever. 
Line drive to short and caught. Now the left fielder, Jesse Winker. 2-2 Two -two now. To the right side. Sneaks through, base hit. Kept it close, though. No error on the bobble. And runners hold at first and second. Now so a clutch A-B could end this one. Digging in, Ty France. Sends it to Walsh. They miss a big chance to take the lead here late. Tenth inning coming up. All tied 1-1. Two outs. Swings and lines a base hit into left field. And that'll put runners at the corners with two away. Comes and he usually wins the battle. Now here is Matt Duffy. And a pop-up right side foul territory. White brings it in, and that is that. On to the bottom of inning number 10. All tied, 1-1. Long enough and played right into the hands of the pitcher. Two-two down. And he grounds one back up the middle. Face it into center field. Runner around third on his way to the plate. It crosses the winning run. And they walk it off in extra innings. You know, he had to feel the pressure. Winning run on second base. Found a way to make solid contact. And the winning run comes across to score. Everyone going crazy. Exciting finish to this game today. Final score here today, 2-1. A one-run extra inning win for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Schaub. Thanks for joining us. Our final line score tonight. First for the victorious Seattle Mariners. Two runs on five hits. Inside the show. Inside the show with Justin Allegri. Inside the show. Inside the show. Inside the show. Here's your host, Justin Allegri. Welcome, everyone. A very happy Easter. Inside the show. And now your host, Justin Allegri. It's Monday morning, and welcome to Inside the Show. Starting in the AL West, the Seattle Mariners pitched well, allowing only three hits as they got the home victory against the Astros 2-1. to one. As of right now, the Mariners are in first place in the AL West Central Division, while the Giants are atop the NL West. The Royals knocked out 12 hits as a team as they cruised to the win against the Tigers 8-2. Heading into the day, the Royals sit in third place in the American League Central, and the Tigers are fourth in the division. The Marlins grabbed 13 hits in the game as they defeated the visiting Fightin' Phils 7-2. As of today, the Marlins are atop the National League East division, and the Phillies are second in the division. The Arizona Diamondbacks knocked out 10 hits as a team as they took care of the Mets at City Field 7-4. In the standings, the Mets sit in third place in the National League East Division, and the Diamondbacks sit in third place in the National League West Division. The St. Louis Cardinals totaled 11 hits. Drays are in third place in the NL West, and the Braves sit in last place in the National League East. Inside the show. Inside the show. Visiting Giants, four to nothing. The Washington Nationals amassed four.
inside the show. Here's your inside the show with Justin Allegri. Welcome to your Saturday edition of Inside the Show. I'm Justin Elias. The Twins, 8-1. to one. The Miami Marlins went deep four times as they pulverized the Braves, 10-3. to three. The Phillies got the best of the Brewers at home, 2-1. to one. The San Francisco Giants hit three long balls as they pulled away from the Nationals, 9-2. to two. The Chicago Cubs sank the visiting Buccos, 6-2. to two. The Reds racked up 11 hits as a team as they got the best of the visiting Redbirds, 6-3. The Diamondbacks combined to give up just five hits as they got the best of the visiting Mets. Inside the show.